Right, hello, it's N60 Sean, and there are storylines in this match. The main story being it's my birthday. So, if I'm going to do a video on my birthday, I'm going to be in it. So, N60 Sean is going to be in a fatal four-way ladder match. And uh, it's going to be a bit different, because I thought on uh, last week, we introduced a a belt which had a picture of my face as a baby some thought it was cute some thought it was the most terrifying thing they'd ever seen in their lives how can my beautiful one-year-old face ever be terrifying i know it was it's pretty it was a bit, a bit creepy uh, so as it is a birthday belt it was a belt that was introduced to celebrate the birthday of the n60 sean series why not have it as a belt to just celebrate birthdays in general? So, uh, I've also got a little bit of a problem with this guy. Not real life, in the story. Because at N60 Mania, I was uh, unceremoniously jumped by this man. This man who was annoyed that he wasn't a part of N60 Mania. So after I was having a lovely little chat with Sunday, and, uh, uh, Sunday, this is on Sunday, uh, Vanos attacked me at, at, at ringside, absolutely beat the living nonsense out of me, and then hit a twisting splash off a ladder from the inside of the ring to the outside, and then snuck in to the Money in the Bank ladder match at the expense of exploding TNT. So uh, with that sort of ladder nonsense, me and Vanos have got an issue to settle, so that's why he's a part of this ladder match. Jack Septicai is also a part of this ladder match because if I was going to have a birthday party and I had to invite any YouTuber, I'd probably invite Jack Septicai. So Jack Septicai is going to be in this match and an old feud for him is going to be revived here because that's back in season one. He uh, beat Xavier Woods in the original series. Xavier Woods got his revenge in the one year anniversary battle royal, eliminating both Jack Septicai and Septicai Sam to win the birthday belt. So. Why not have Jack and Xavier Woods also slash Austin Creed settle their differences in this match? One more plot twist still to come. One more plot twist as uh, Jack waits for Austin Creed, the WWE YouTuber, to come to the ring. Oh man, I I do enjoy the new day. It should be for the one-time birthday champ, but. But the, the, the next twist is that while well, he's defending the birthday belt, today is actually Austin Creed's birthday. We share a birthday. We're birthday buds. So Austin Creed on his birthday, defending the birthday championship against me on my birthday is I settle my issue with Vanos and Jack Zedekai just comes along for the party and settles his issue with Xavier Woods. It's, it's nice how sometimes these matches come together as Austin Creed grooves his way to the ring. Uh, Austin Creed, uh, the Up Up Down Down uh, host, which is the WWE gaming YouTube channel, which is why he qualifies for our YouTubers division. He's just not like a WWE guy, just, you know, muscling on in. So here we go, a fatal four-way tables, ladders, and chairs match. And here... <laughs> <laughs> Look at it! Oh man, like, when I get a million subs, I'm making that belt. I'm gonna get it to happen. So here we go! N60 Sean, Vanos, Jacksepticeye, Austin Creed, it's party time! It's the birthday party, the birthday championship, as the birthday boys start off by, uh, with a front face lock in the centre of the ring and Vanos is going straight for a ladder and gets cleaned out by Jack Septicai. Of course, Jack Septicai and Vanos have also got their issues. Long, long time rivals who uh, reignited their rivalry in the Money in the Bank ladder match at N60 Mania and oh! I mean, that is not a birthday present that I would want. A steel chair straight to the face from Austin Creed who's absolutely going in with that steel chair. And a birthday chair to the face. Now, the birthday chair when I was at home used to be when my mum used to put all my presents <clears throat> all on a chair. Like, so I go downstairs, birthday morning, all my birthday presents would be on the birthday chair. Austin Creed putting a new meaning to the birthday chair by smashing one in my face. And now I'm giving an Austin Creed a birthday chair of his own. 
Swinging for the fences. Oh, and now Austin Creed takes that chair away. Goes for the drop kick, but misses. And now N60 Sean just getting out of there, seeing that there's two chairs in the ring, and this time opting to bring a table into the ring. Jack Septicai. Is Jack Septicai going to turn up to this birthday party and take the birthday bell? And oh, he just sends Vanos straight into that ladder as N60 Sean wrestles. Like N60 Sean and Austin Creed just absolutely fighting over these chairs. And now a nice suplex from Austin Creed. Is Vanos is going up top here? Could be looking for the flying owl. But I think Jack Septicai just managed to crawl out of the way to avoid that. N60 Sean looking, uh, uh, oh, look how sad I'm looking on my birthday, sat outside of the ring. And Austin Creed plants Jack Septicai with the reverse DDT. And now Vanos, which again, tried to pick up a ladder, but gets absolutely munched in the process. Goes for a right hand on Xavier Woods, but uh, he manages to just wriggle out of it. And there's a ladder to the face of Austin Creed. And a ladder shot to the back of Vanos's head. And now Vanos is good. Now Vanos has got the ladder in. Oh! That was a stiff, stiff ladder shot by Vanos. Reverse uh, neck breaker from Jack Septicai. Uppercut into my kidneys. <clears throat> and now uh, Xavier Woods with a twisting neck breaker to uh, N60 Sean. There's another ladder shot straight to the knee. And now Xavier Woods could be looking for the honor roll here. But oh, just as he was about to smack me up with the honor roll, Jack Septicai with a cheeky little ladder managing to knock me down, which completely messed things up for Xavier Woods. And now Jack has climbed up the ladder, looking to grab the title. The first birthday belt just hanging from the top of the ring. I'm still not entirely sure what we're going to call that belt. The first birthday belt, the baby face belt. I mean, it will make you the number one baby face in the entire company by grabbing that belt. And maybe whoever wins should have a picture of their one-year-old self on that belt. And as Xavier Woods, Austin Creed, gets floored with a glorious kick from N60 Sean. And oh, that is a sick move from Vanos. I don't think I've seen him do that move as he takes me down with a Japanese arm drag. And quite rightfully so, I'm rolling out of the ring to get my bearings. Delightful stuff from Vanos is uh, Jack went to try and throw Austin Creed out of the ring. And these two rivals... Who rival, whose rivalry started exactly one year ago. And now Vanos has got the belt. And now this is getting serious. I mean, party time is over because at the end of the day, championship gold is on the line. Even if that championship gold does contain a picture of my one-year-old face on it. And now Woods and Vanos go for the ride. And a belly-to-belly -belly suplex to Jack from N60 Sean. And everybody's down. And this could be a nice time for me to climb up the ladder. But Jack Septicai is back up. Jack now in the corner and is now thrown to the outside looking for that springboard drop kick nice ring awareness great strategy from N60 Sean now climb the ladder son get that birthday belt get yourself a cheeky little birthday present but hang on N60 Sean's got a different idea here and oh Vanos snuck in the ring and I think N60 Sean spotted that oh I thought we were going to see chaos but Vanos being the heel that he is robbing everybody of that mo of that moment and uh, Austin Creed plants him with a with a back body drop Jack's now back in the ring it's just kicked me right in the spine that is going to hurt and oh hang on this does not look good for me and while Jack's concentrating on whatever he's going to hit me with Xavier Woods is up on the top trying to re retain the birthday belt and Jack Septicai with the jackhammer and Austin Creed still clinging on to that birthday belt is Vanos with those right hands right to the sort of base of the spine and Jack with a springboard elbow joint. Oh, oh, that was like some Matrix stuff from Austin Creed. Sort of fell off the ladder but still managed to pick it up and smack Vanos out of the ring. And a sit-out powerbomb by Jack and Austin Creed determined to try and walk away from this, champion, from, from this championship match still with the gold around his waist. And those elbows, his <laughs> buttock based elbows, I'm sorry, there's no, I can't just say it's the space of the spine, it's on his bum cheeks. And Creed still just kicking away Jack. He is relentlessly grabbing on to that championship belt. And N60 Sean climbing up the top of the ladder. And there's a big old drop from N60 Sean and Xavier Woods as we've both, and now Vanos, oh, Vanos was all alone there. Everyone else was outside of the ring. And I think that was a little bit of a mistake from Vanos, who's a veteran of the ladder match. He's been in quite a few. And now Jack 
all on his own. Is Jack going to be the guy who turns up to the birthday party just so he can uh, play with all your birthday presents? As he's in the middle of the ring, the ladder is set up and Jack's climbing up. Is Jack going to hijack this birthday celebration from Austin Creed and N60 Sean? And he's got the belt, but Vanos seems to have pushed the ladder away, caught Jack Septicai and plants it. If Vanos was invited to a birthday party, he's probably the guy who just turned up and break all your presents. As he gets thrown off to the shot of the rope, said, oh, and if you break my presents, I'm going to drop the nut on you. What a headbutt that was. And, I'm not, and now the birthday boys at the top of the ladder. The two birthday boys brawling. Whoever comes out on top of this contest could be walking away champion. And Vanos pushing everybody celebrating a birthday down from the top. And now Vanos has got the ladder. And could Vanos be sneaking this one? Everybody's down. Vanos climbing up the top of the ladder. Are you serious? Is Vanos going to win this? Oh, wait. Vanos is going right to the top of the ladder. And Vanos, oh! Twisting Phoenix Splash. The same move that he delivered to N60 Sean at N60 Mania. Off the top of the ladder. Went for another suplex, but N60 Sean just managing to wriggle out of it as Creed sends Jack flying out of the ring and I've just hit Vanos with a powerbomb. How, how am I managing that after that move which Vanos just delivered? Woods hit with an elbow. Manages to roll out the ring and now Jack's sneaking up. Is Jack going to walk away with the first birthday belt? And he could be doing it. This could be Jack walking away as champion but N60 Sean just managing to push that ladder away as Jack is dangling. He's a dangling. And I just hit him with another powerbomb. Who is going to walk away champion? As oh, I, was, I thought Vanos was going to go flying then, but nah. <laughs> no dice. Elbow to the face of N60 Sean. Feynman's carry. Vanos landing on that ladder. N60 Sean picking it up, but gets taken out with that nicely placed drop kick to the kneecaps of Vanos. N60 Sean battling away. Austin Creed is back into the ring now. Got to be looking at a new champion here. And I am looking absolutely... Oh, man, I was trying to chill. For like two seconds, I was just trying to chill. And Austin Creed just bumped me on the head with a ladder. And I give him an elbow for good measure. And now Austin Creed flies out of the ring. I've got a steel chair. Jack set me up for the power bomb. I've still got a steel chair in hand. Can I buff? Oh, I thought I was going to just be able to buff, in, buff Jack Septicai on the head with that chair. But now, Jack with that Boston Crab. And I'm a tapping, but that is not how you win this ladder match. You need to climb that ladder. You need to get the belt. But if that was a normal match, I was tapping out in Vanos now. He's at the top. And Vanos this time not going for any special moves. He's got his hands on the belt. Creed climbing up to try and stop it and retain his championship. But both of these guys are in trouble because if Jack Jacksepticeye pushes that ladder down and plants Vanos, he could be walking away with the championship. Creed rolling out of the ring. Vanos in a lot of trouble here. Jack has got the ladder. And oh, but just before he could set it up, Vanos with a spin kick. Trying to just use that ladder as a weapon. And now Enzi still going for another powerbomb. Gets taken out with a ladder. And Vanos now setting up the ladder. Is Vanos going to steal the birthday belt? And now N60 Sean sent sprawling to the outside of the ring onto Jack Septicai's head. And now Vanos climbing up the ladder. He's got his hands on the belt. But Creed's back in the ring and just manages to push the ladder down. Getting to the business end of this match now. Someone is going to be walking away with that championship. Is it going to be Vanos? Is it going to be Jack? Is it going to be me? Is it going to be Austin Creed? Jack sets up the ladder. And Creed flies in with a DDT. N60 Sean sneaks up the ladder. And Creed, who's picking up Jack, and... Oh, I've snuck it! <laughs> N60 Sean! I haven't won a match for ages. With a little birthday present to himself. And wait a second. He's got a belt with his own. Wait, hang on, that masked guy! And that masked guy crashing the celebration. And... With an RKO slash diamond cutter like move on N60 Sean. And that mask guy who's probably getting some revenge for N60 Sean putting Timmy Taylor and Mr. Mister, his masters, in a Hell in a Cell match at N60 Mania, which cost them their championship gold. And now Jack, Jack with that table which was outside the ring. Jack now coming to N60 Sean's aid, flooring the masked guy and going to work with him with that table. 
Jack now setting up that table, but just before he can do anything with it, the mask guy escapes the scene. And these mask guys, man, they need dealing with. Bad masks, people. It was my birthday and everything. Anyway, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, uh, have an amazing day, guys. Have an amazing week. Have an amazing life and stuff. Watch some more videos. Uh, if you want, if you want to throw another birthday present my way, follow me on Twitter. Share this video with some friends. Drop a like on it. But I mean, birthdays aside and stuff. Hope you guys are all excellent. You're amazing, and I will see you in the next video. Should probably be on Wednesday, which is going to be what? Oh, it's going to be the tag team title match. It's going to be Crundy versus Bendy and his partner of choosing for winning the Gamers versus Games uh, Battle Royal. Right, get on with your live citizens. Watch more videos. Bye.